What is up guys? We are here for a day of eating. This time we're doing low carb edition. So it's a rest day for me today. I wanna to show you guys my low carb diet. We're kind of pulling me down a little bit now, getting me ready for a big carb up for Vancouver, seeing that we're 10 days out. We leave for Vancouver in six days, so getting super excited. Um, but yeah, let's just get into the meals. I don't wanna to chat too, too much. I'm really hungry, I'm already late today and I got a bunch of work to do. So for meal number one, we have two organic eggs, one cup of egg whites, and then we have the shake, which you guys have seen before. So I have one scoop of Jack Factory chocolate peanut butter isolate, one scoop of Green Surge from Jack Factory chocolate mint flavored, and one scoop of, or actually two scoops of glutamine for 10 grams. So all that's blended up with a little bit of ice, make a delicious little shake. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna put this one down. No carbs in this first meal. Then meals two, three, four five have carbs and then meal six has no carbs so we'll show you all those i gotta get this meal down and get to work but we will see you guys for meal number two okay i gotta show you guys this real quick i uh, just pulled this out of the oven so doing some meal prep today as well but one of the perks of living in newfoundland canada is we get awesome awesome codfish atlantic codfish this guy's is like straight from local fisheries right off the boat Get really good deals on this and it's just immaculate quality fish so i just put a little bit of lemon garlic i think it's called uh, flavor god seasoning so no calories really low sodium makes it taste really good but we'll be doing this for a couple meals today so really looking forward to that just pulled it out of the oven so we'll put some tin foil down kind of helps keep the moisture in and everything and make it taste nice and good so anyways finally gotta go eat it's about to 16 hours before the prejudging you know, 16 probably, you, you can uh, uh, stop and then just sit. Okay guys, here for meal number two. So we just went out, had to run a couple of little errands. I picked up some games for my Switch that I bought recently for all the traveling I'm gonna have coming up. So I got Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, it's supposed to be epic, and I got a Pokemon game because why not, right? If you have any advice on which Switch games I should pick up, comment below, let me know. Also got a big ass coffee from Starbs black uh, blonde roast venti of course and for the meal so you guys saw that beautiful cod earlier so we have some of that in there it's always hard to show you guys this stuff but we have uh eight ounces of cod 250 grams of rice and about 100 grams of green beans that i air fried with a quarter teaspoon of pink salt so that's what we're doing now for this meal take a little test some of this fresh cod so good kind of it's good for me right now but you guys probably won't think it's that good but cheers very meaty that's the difference between like the cod here i find in like store-bought cod if i got it at like walmart or something like that <clears throat> cod is just like rubbery and like just gross a lot of it's like pacific cod for some reason it makes it all the way over here uh but atlantic cod especially caught locally the best in newfoundland so Cheers guys, we'll see you for meal three. Okay guys, here for meal number three, late on this meal. Uh, this whole day is just late, but I, I was already late on this meal and then I went to get it and forgot I didn't cook rice. <laughs> so now we're like a half an hour later than being late. So, but we got our chicken and zucchini done. That's ready to go. Uh, I'm just gonna weigh out this rice real quick. Our 250 grams. See if I can do this without making a mess. Here we go, 250. And we have our chicken and zucchini cooked up on the pan. And last but not least, we have our pink salt here, guys. So we have a quarter teaspoon measure. We're doing a quarter teaspoon on each meal. So we'll just throw that on. And that's our sodium. So that's about 440 milligrams of sodium on each meal. And here we have the meal. Eight ounce chicken, 150 grams of zucchini, 250 grams of rice, yum. But yeah guys, I gotta get this in. Like I said, I'm late on this one, so we will see you for meal number four. So I just wanna show you this, what I've been drinking every day, uh, roasted dandelion root tea. So I usually do this uh, after meal three or after meal four. Basically just like a natural diuretic, um, especially where our carbs are like all over the place lately. Uh, some days are super high, some days are super low. I find this uh, just keeps my, being regular just makes my body not hold water and I notice especially my legs with all the cardio and leg training 
in prep sometimes with built up fatigue, you get built up water retention in the legs. So ever since I started drinking this once a day, it's been keeping me peeing and it's been really helping with that. So yeah, just wanted to show you guys that. So here it is. We'll drink that and we'll get another couple liters of water in and that will make sure we don't hold any water uh, when we wake up tomorrow. Okay guys, meal number four. So nothing very exciting to show you. We have our eight ounces of cod with 250 grams of jasmine rice and a quarter teaspoon of pink salt. Um, not doing veggies with the last two carb meals today, just for digestion. I got 300 grams of veggies in between the green beans and zucchini, so that's plenty. Don't want to bound up the digestion at this point. Uh, with this meal, we're doing a scoop of EAA cert, so I did do a scoop with my morning cardio as well. Uh, blue raspberry, probably my favorite flavor, but I like peach, uh, I like pineapple a lot, strawberry uh, limeade's good as well. Uh, cucumber lime I like, but it's not my favorite, but I like this one. So, guys, code Big Mo, get this, save yourself 15% and on all other Jack Factory products and merch. I gotta get this down, guys. We're heading to a massage appointment. It's supposed to be 6.30, so yeah, gotta eat. All right, guys, we are back from the massage appointment. It was really successful. Loosen my neck, my traps up, I feel great. Uh, but it's 8.20, we have to get meal number five in right now because at 10 o'clock I want to be having meal six so I can go to bed because these low carb days, by the end of them, I'm dead. Even though I didn't train today, still the cardio and abs this morning that like literally took the good out of me. So anyway, let's get to it. Show you guys this meal. So this one I kind of do up a little bit different because I get peanut butter with it. And of course, if you get peanut butter, you can turn anything into the dessert. But first things first, we're just going to eat our eight ounces of chicken straight up out of the bowl, get it over with, and then we're gonna get to enjoy this little concoction I make with uh, 250 grams of rice. Uh, I put some cinnamon, some pink salt on there as well. Uh, this is the peanut butter I'm using, guys. The goat of peanut butters. If you know, you know. So damn good, creamy, delicious, and healthy. So yeah, I'm gonna eat the chicken first, then I'm gonna enjoy this amazing concoction. Look at that peanut butter melted into that rice. Uh, I would normally put a Splenda in there too, but we're where we are so close to show I'm cutting out the uh, extra sweeteners, just no need right now. And if we can get the skin a little bit thinner, and that's what does it, it's worth it, right? So I'm gonna go enjoy this meal, chill out on the couch, and just relax finally for today. Um, and then yeah, we'll show you guys what I do for the last meal, so stay tuned. Okay guys, excuse my face right now. I just woke up from a nap. Right after that meal, I was just passed out on the couch, so pretty tough day today, but uh, I'm going to show you guys the last meal, and then we're going to call it a night. So here we go, meal number six. Nothing crazy, guys. We have two scoops of Jack Factory Authentic Whey, salted chocolate caramel flavor, two scoops of glutamine, blend it up with ice into a delicious shake. So the plan is to drink this and get right in bed. Try to get back to sleep before I get hungry because I don't want to be up very early tomorrow morning being hungry from the low carbs today. So we'll see how things look in the morning and we'll go from there. If I get a high day, I might do another uh, day of eating, uh, but we'll just see how it goes. So, but thanks guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed my starvation diet and what it takes to get shredded. We'll see you on the next one.